Hi. I have the house to myself, and I can run this game now. So it's time to play some King of Fighters. With the most powerful competitor known to man, Lenny Kravitz. Excellent. Who I've taken the painstaking effort of emblazoning him with his logo of his favorite candy bar. Who are we gonna fight now? Tanya. Alright, let's uh, get a move on here. Gonna sing it real quick. It's <laughs> a pretty good uh, sound sample there. Also, I'm not even gonna bother to use the weapons because uh, all the weapons are well fucking done. terrible in this game. So, they're all slow and it's just. Wow. They ain't great. Anyway, who the hell's this guy? It should really be giving me famous characters like uh, Adraman and Kira, but no. Just these underdogs, like Kung Lao, like anybody gives a shit about him. <laughs> My favorite Kravitz maneuver. I'm gonna have to post a video of my top 10 favorite Kravitz maneuvers, and that's definitely going to be one of them. <laughs> and there goes Billy Jack. Excellent. Got now. Johnny Cage. That clearly Fight. just says Cage. It's not. How do you know if that's Johnny? He has like he has a couple of sons. You know, there's Mike Cage and there's Tom Cage. And you're just gonna you're just gonna pass him by by uh is that a is that a trap? Or? Hold on. There seems to be like a trap outline there, but uh I don't know if they're uh is there anything you can throw them in down there with? Or maybe they just, uh... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'm seeing things. Anyway, this amazing character from Garu Mark of the Wolves. Uh... She's looking quite warlordy in this game. Which is an adjective that you are free to use, uh... Free of charge. Outstanding. Actually, that I don't think that's a... Crap outline. I think that's just an outline for the stage and the emulation is just making it look weird. Anyway, we got uh, another obscure character here. Oh! Wait, come on. We know Aqua can take this guy in a fight. Like, who the hell cares about this guy? Whoa! Really, I was like doing that uh, kick uppercut though. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, it's always good to rejuvenate by having a Milky Way. And this guy, I think he's one of the villains. Because his name means bad guy. He's definitely not a product of Ed Boon, Marathon, and Shaw Brothers movies and being like, Hey, I have a cool idea. Why don't we make a Shaw Brothers character and put it in Mortal Kombat? And then we'll give like eight different characters the same hairstyle because it's just so cool. In fact, we're even going to put it in the creation system to give the hairstyle the name Shaw to really make it subtle. And also a funny thing. So the critic characters all have the same combo string, so it's not really that hard to Excellent. play as any of them, really. Same commands for special moves. And Raiden. Oh, we got Farmer. Fight. He's looking very pissed off today. 
That's what happens when you cross farmer. But you know, we're we're outstanding, so it's uh, it's all good. Speaking of farmer, I was going to make him, then I made somebody else. So uh, we're going to play as a previous champion that you may have seen. Uh, but we're gonna pick uh, possibly the dumbest stage. Excellent. So yeah, I brought Crunch Duncan's back. After stunting the ECW, things went horribly wrong for her. But, you know, she is doing okay for herself at the same time. Because her life is an anomaly. And we're fighting Farmer again. Please so that's good. Fight. I forgot what I gave this lady. Oh, I gave her the ability to switch sides for no reason. See, the thing about the outward spiral, or spire, uh, is you don't have to have buildings that actually end. You just have them go down the stairs forever. It really pisses off the landlord. Fight! So, uh, we got counter lock here. And we're gonna try to throw my chandeliers! No! Okay, I guess maybe things that uh, didn't, uh, <laughs> go out as planned for her. Nah, she... Nah, she can't, uh... She can't go down like this. Excellent. She was taught never to be called a weakling. And, uh, she wasn't really taught anything else, so... It's kind of convenient. But... That's why she's going to hell. Alongside, uh... F oh, Jade. Jade. Yeah, that one ninja that, uh, has a ton of personality, you know. <laughs> Oh my god. Hell of a combo there. I think Crunch Duncan broke the game. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh... That, like, messes up their model. It's pretty good. <laughs> pretty good ability to have. Also, the funny thing is, I tried to give her a full shirt. The, this game is so, in its own words, trying to, like, make every single lady sexy, because they explicitly said that, and I guess that amounts to the creation system, too, because God forbid that you make a normal-looking lady. You know, God forbid that somebody is sexy while wearing clothes. Because that's just not in this era of Mortal Kombat's equation. That doesn't exist, you know, Anna Williams, but, you know. I, I think Crunch may be broken. Not, not really sure yet, but. Excellent. Also, I like how um, Melina's uh, uh, something there is uh, floating in midair. Because, uh. Fight! Whoa! Why does. <laughs> okay, so it works fine if you combo it into itself, but. Whoa. Oh, these sounds. Also, a lot of these voice clips I'm starting to notice go on way too long. Yeah, it's the good old teleport. What the da Here we got now. Johnny Cage. Why, why am I getting the same people over and over again? We have, like, all these characters. And... <laughs> it's just giving me the same shit. It's like Mugen all over again. Okay, so if you time that a certain way, it breaks. I forgot where my block button was. Ah, oh, there. Ooh. Excellent. Uh, being in hell has never been so much fun. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> we have this uh, star claim of a design here. See, she has Hiragana on her wings because uh, she's cool. Not just a bunch of fetishes rolled up in one character would we'll, we'll, we'll give you that idea. It's like, she's got like a jacket, but then she forgot to like bring other clothes. So maybe she just really rushed that day. Anyway, we're going to close things out by uh, playing as the famous Street Fighter character, Gookie. But, uh, let's Excellent. go to the wastelands for this. Because, uh, there's no other place for Gookie to be. Yeah, he just has the Shaolin fist. But it's no match for a Baccarate. Mostly because we can just keep doing that. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> it's just the most useless projectile. I was really hoping the peak would actually damage them so that I could like make them explode, but and that's the one thing that keeps this game from being perfect. Oh, what? <laughs> yeah, you know, <laughs> it's totally perfect. Oh. Okay, okay. Impressive. They turned the wasteland and like... Chameleon. I don't know. <laughs> this is like quite different. Anyway, uh, you know, uh... This guy. A lot to say about him. I don't even know why I'm being, uh, snooty. Uh, I actually think he's in the concept. It's just, you know, he's in here. God, the weapons feel so bad. Well done. Look his head just bubbling away there. Luke Kang's looking pretty Fight. dapper today. Whoa, what? <laughs> Accidentally did a breaker there. Also, it's weird that it took them until the game where he turned into a zombie to realize that the Bruce Lee characters don't do the Bruce Lee noises every single time they make a noise. Chain have like. <laughs> Tanya. It looked like it was like an actual limb there because I had like a bloody stump. <laughs> this is uh, the transition where Tanya was on her way to becoming a really cool design, but you know, she had to figure out what pants were first. So. I keep uh, accidentally doing parries. There's so much good tech in this game. Ah, yes, Shao Kahn's uh, love struck stalker. He sounds like that. What the? Pretty good throw uh, hitbox there, which you know it took about like three times to actually connect. So that's good. <laughs> well, we didn't get to show off the death trap, but uh, yeah, you... I'm thinking a night trap. Never mind. Uh, yeah, that joke doesn't work anymore. All right. So yeah, that's oh, uh, that's all I got. So uh.
See you later.